the United States has returned more than 250 ancient artifacts to Italy after police discovered that they had been stolen. The art unit of Italy's police force found the items had been looted and sold to U.S. museums and private collectors in the 1990s. Among the precious artifacts include pots, paintings and sculptures some up to 3,000 years old. Several of the mosaics are worth tens of millions of euros. The oldest item dates back to the Villanovan age, 1000 to 750 BC, while other artifacts were from the Etruscan civilization, 800 to 200 BC, Magna Graecia, 750 to 400 BC, and Imperial Rome, 27 BC, 476 Sad. Most artifacts had been stolen in the 1990s, then sold through a series of dealers with one selection apparently being offered to the Manil Collection, a museum in Houston, Texas. The Italian culture of ministry said the artifacts were on display in the Manil Collection, but a spokesperson for the museum denied this and said they had never been a part of the collection. The spokesperson said the museum had been offered the artifacts as a gift but instead referred the donor to Italy's culture ministry. The ministry said the owner of the collection spontaneously returned the items after police found that they had come from illegal excavations of archaeological sites. Separately, the ministry said that 145 of the returned artifacts had come from a bankruptcy procedure against an English antiques dealer, Robin Symes, who amassed thousands of pieces as part of a network of illegal traders. Italy has long sought to track down antiques and artifacts that have been stolen and sold to private collectors and museums. In September 2022, New York returned $19 million, a pound 16 meters, worth of stolen art to Italy, including a marble head of the goddess Athena dated 200 BC, worth an estimated $3 million alone.